He's standing for a short time. He's really funny, though. It's his first time on TV. Please welcome Jimbo. Thank you. Um, there's now six billion people alive today, which is more people than the total amount of people who have ever died in the history of the human race, which statistically means that dying is now an unusual experience for a human to go through. <laughs> Which means if someone comes up to you and says their grandmother's died, instead of saying I'm sorry, you're now well within your rights to say how peculiar. <laughs> I heard a song on the radio the other day called Life by Desiree and it went, I'm, a, I'm afraid of the dark, especially when I'm in a park. I don't like ghosts. That's the side I fear most. I'd rather have a piece of toast. Life. I mean, what's that all about? <laughs> Why can't you just be honest and go, I'm afraid of the dark. That rhymes with park. I don't like ghosts, that rhymes with most, also rhymes with toast, life. <laughs> so devoid of meaning, I may as well top myself now. <laughs> that rhymes with cow. <laughs> I can just imagine some depressed 15 year old sitting at home and life comes on the radio and at the end he goes, gee, is that all? <laughs> and some kid who's slightly less depressed goes, oh, I may as well have a piece of toast. <laughs> I was a bit depressed the other day, I was, uh, um, I was catching a bus outside the hospital where I was born and I got to thinking about how far I'd come in my life and all that. And, and I worked it out to be about 50 metres. <laughs> now I'm 29, that's about one centimetre a day. <laughs> bus driver woke me up at the depot and he said, you've come a long way. And I shook his hand and I said, thanks mate, that, that means a lot to me. <laughs> and he said, mate, it'd mean a lot to me if you got off the bus. <laughs> I got home and I got a statement from the bank and on it it said, don't worry about the Y2K bug, the record of your money is safe with us. And I thought, great, because I'd hate to lose that $4,000 debt. <laughs> but I've been, been getting it together lately. I'm on the uh, cigarette patches. Um, I'm not actually a smoker, but I want to be. <laughs> and nicotine gives me head spins though, but I figure a month of these, I'll be able to go straight to Winnie Reds. <laughs> I'm also thinking of taking up methadone. Apparently there's a product out now called I Can't Believe It's Not Heroin. <laughs> but um, I've also worked out my life mission and that's to uh, make a doona out of belly button fluff. <laughs> and and I, I know it's going to be hard and there's going to be good and bad days. But... <laughs> But by the time I get to that nursing home, I'm going to be warm. <laughs> Thanks a lot, everyone.